Well, good weather for skiing at your favorite resort this St. Patrick's Day weekend. Hello, I'm meteorologist Josh Fitzpatrick outside live at the top of one degree resort. Nice sunrise and blue skies up above. They still have a decent snowpack and wintergreen mass and nothing. You'll be able to make snow at night over the next several nights as temperatures go near or below freezing. Right now it's in the low 40s in downtown Charlottesville, Orange, Louisa, Palmyra, Lake Monticello, mid 30s at uh, Harrisonburg, Stanton to Waynesboro. So it is a much colder morning compared to the, the past couple of mornings when we had temperatures in the 50s and the 60s. Now, right now, our exclusive dual pole triple Doppler radar shows dry skies, as you can imagine, with the clear conditions, no precipitation, high pressure will keep us dry today, tonight, tomorrow. And for the most part, most of next week, a few clouds over the Allegheny front. They had some snow showers, a little bit of a fresh snowpack over to our neighbors to the west at uh, Snowshoe Mountain in West Virginia. But the main snow showers coming off the Great Lakes will stay up this way, coming off of Lake Ontario, Lake Erie, Lake Huron, also from Lake Michigan and also Lake Superior, seeing all those snow showers. So staying well north of us, expect more in the way of dry weather, not only here, but basically all the way west to the west coast. So the main storm track stays two hours southeast. The Gulf of Mexico is shut off. So that means our next weather maker, which is right now over north of South Dakota, as that moves southeast, no moisture is moving north. So the next system that arrives here later on tomorrow night will be moisture starved. So future cast shows sunshine today, clear skies tonight, lows back near freezing, highs tomorrow back in the 50s with a few clouds increasing. So here we go tomorrow evening. Watch the clouds increase from the west. A nice sunset during the 7 o'clock hour tomorrow evening. And then by 1 a.m. early Monday morning, either a brief rain or a snow shower. Could be a few flurries north on early Monday morning towards the Madison, Culpeper, and into D.C. and Baltimore. That's where the best chance for snow will be, but really no accumulation expected. We're dry on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. A little disturbance tries to pass by on Friday, but mainly it's a dry forecast for the next seven to maybe 10 days around here. How about that? So today's forecast, mid 50s for Charlottesville, where we should be for March standards, low 50s in the Shenandoah Valley sunshine, a brisk northwest wind, calmer tonight, lows near or slightly below freezing by this time tomorrow morning, but we are dry and chilly. And for Sunday, St. Patrick's Day forecast, low 50s, Charlottesville, orange to Lake Monticello, low 50s in St. Waynesboro, mostly sunny. Some clouds arrive by the end of the day. Michael and Son, seven day forecast, a very small chance for a sprinkle or a flurry while we're sleeping on Sunday nights, drying out Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, first day of spring, Wednesday in the 50s, and the first couple of full days of spring, Thursday and Friday in the low 60s and lows in the 30s, where we should be for March standards. That's one of the driest stretches we've had in the past year and a half, Pete. Can't wait for it, Josh. And luckily, no uh, green on that Doppler radar for St. Patty's Day. I know. How about that? And I can't wear green. Tomorrow, <laughs> because of the green screen, so I might get uh, I guess, guess it'll just be me. All <laughs> right, right, Josh, thank you very much. Stay with us. More to come after the break.